Is it me? Am I the drama? I don't think I'm the drama. Maybe I am. Am I the villain? I don't think I'm the villain. Are you going to f me? I would certainly like to. I know you would. King Julian! I convinced Russia to invade Ukraine! But we cannot move it, move it, if we get drafted. But I want to cause an international crisis. Mord, what the fuck? I really wish I wasn't living through a historical event right now. Breaking news! Russian President Vladimir Putin has declared war on Ukraine. He announced that Russia will be conducting a military operation in the Donbass region of Ukraine. Multiple Ukrainian cities are beginning to report noises of loud explosions going off. The war is officially unfolding. Everyone knows that Russia is planning to invade Ukraine 69 times, but hardly anyone has noticed this broader implication. Russia has moved nearly all of their troops thousands of miles to its western border, leaving the back east flank completely unprotected. This will allow Mongolia to sweep in from the east, taking all of Siberia and re-establishing the Great Khanate. Non-biased and independent sources claim that the Khan will trample all who do not surrender without mercy. Russia must now yield or face his wrath. Hey, my name's Lewis Spears. I just wanted to jump on social media real quick and say that, ooh, my foot really hurts. Ow, ouch. There's no way that I could like run into battle on this fort or because it's really hurting. I certainly couldn't carry any any wounded brother or, or it, it hurts so bad I wouldn't even be able to stand in a trench. It just really, really hurt my foot. And I just wanted to say that publicly on social media, on record on the 24th of February, 2022 at uh, 8.27 PM that, oh, ouchie, my foot really hurts. And, and I just wouldn't be any use in battle. And I certainly wouldn't be able to be conscripted. So I just wanted to post that out there, let you know how I'm feeling. And oh, ow, sorry, I've got to go. I can barely even film this video. My foot hurts. Too. I see a lot of people in the liberal media saying that Russia should not invade Ukraine, but I just wanted to give you a little different perspective that you may not have thought about. My father, my brother, and I own a small defense contracting company that specializes in surface-to-air missiles, and this year's been pretty tough. With Joe Biden ending the war in Afghanistan and Iraq, we've had to cut back. You know, my parents had to cancel their yearly trip to the Red Sea because my dad can't even expense it anymore. He has no reason to go. And I had to downsize my falcon rookery. And if you've ever seen your staff get picked apart by 50 angry adult falcons who don't want to move into a smaller rookery, then you know that's hard. What I'm trying to say is sometimes not going to war hurts just as many people as going to war. So the next time you want to take your little liberal arts degree from Vassar College into World Affairs, just think about that.